grace and peace to you all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, the one who is able to keep us from falling. Africa University is 20 years young. It started. It started with a dream of Bishop Emilio de Cavallo and Bishop Arthur Kula when they came to the General Conference and asked, help us establish a university on the continent of Africa to train leaders in a Christian environment. Africa University started with 40 students in renovated farm buildings. If you go to that place today, there you will find 28 modern and complete buildings with one under construction. Africa University now has 1,700 students from, 20, from 27 countries on the continent of Africa. Bishop David K. Yimba of the Democratic Republic of Congo is the Chancellor or Chairman of the Board of Trustees. Bishop Marcus Matthews of the Upper New York Conference is the Vice Chair of the Board. Professor Fanuel Taguira of Zimbabwe is the Vice Chancellor or President of Africa University. It's been said that if you want to know if an institution is successful or not, look at its graduates, see who they are, where they are, and what they are doing. At this general conference, more than 60 graduates of Africa University have been present at one time. Some of them are seated in delegations now. Some of them head their delegations. Some of them are translators and interpreters working at this general conference. We say we don't have to wait until tomorrow to change the world. We can do it today. And we're doing it today. You're doing it by supporting Africa University. We have a number of graduates all over the continent of Africa in 38 countries that we know of. They're in every walk of life and we'd like you to meet one of those graduates who has come to be with us this evening. He's in his delegation, Reverend G. Mandi Muyambo is from the Democratic Republic of Congo. Listen to Reverend Mayambo's story. Good evening. My name is Monday, not Friday. I greet you in the name of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I am a clergy delegate representing the North Katanga area of the Democratic Republic of the Congo. I am a graduate of Africa universities with two degrees, the first one in theology and the second in the Institute of Peace, Leadership and Governance. Right now, I serve as the president of Kamina Methodist University, and I am a board member of the International Association of Methodist School and Universities in the world. Your prayers and gift of the people called United Methodists, which were given to build and support Africa University have changed my life and that of many thousand young men and women in Africa like me. These young men and women 
are answering to the call to service, to heal, to teach, and to preach. I'm a preacher, by the way. And to build a brighter future for their nations. Friends, I am but one piece of the dream. But I stand today representing more than 4,000 like me to say thank you to my church, the United Methodist Church. I am the return of your investment. Thank you for living out a powerful and transforming gospel in a ministry called Africa University. Thank you.